Check out this simple experiment you can do with glucose strips, which shows that Mexican Coke contains the same two sugars that are in high fructose corn syrup. But wait a minute, you might say. Mexican Coke contains cane sugar, not corn syrup. Well, cane sugar is made of the compound sucrose, and sucrose is made of the chemical combination of glucose and fructose. But because the glucose is locked into the sucrose molecule, these glucose strips can't detect it in sugar water. When exposed to an acid environment, like in Coca-Cola, sucrose hydrolyzes. That means it splits into free glucose and fructose. And high fructose corn syrup also contains a mixture of glucose and fructose, just in a little different ratio. So when the glucose strips change color in the Mexican Coke, it's proof that the cane sugar has been converted into the same two sugars that are in high fructose corn syrup. And you know what? Your body does the same thing to sucrose the moment it hits your small intestine, sending these two sugars into your bloodstream. So while it's true that Coca-Cola is replacing its corn syrup with cane sugar, for all practical purposes, it ends up the same. Fructose and glucose, just like in high fructose corn syrup.